another back to school video. So today's video is going to be DIY school supplies. I've always done a video like this every year and I always think it's really fun to be able to DIY your school supplies and make them unique. This way you're not going to run into anyone who has the exact same folder or notebook with the, as you and you're not going to get it mixed up with someone else. A lot of people get school supplies at like Target so if you want to be unique give your notebooks and folders a little personalized touch, then keep on watching this video and I'm going to show you a bunch of ways to do that. So I have several different designs for notebooks and folders that are all very easy to personalize to fit your own personal style, interests, and stuff like that. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's go ahead and jump on into it. For the first notebook, I am starting out with just a plain brown cardboard notebook and then I typed out this lyric that I wanted to write on it with a little design on the top and I mirrored that image. And then I flipped it over backwards onto the paper, lines it up where I wanted it, and then started coloring in with the pencil at the back. And what that does is when you color it, it ends up transferring the ink onto the notebook. So you just have to kind of color hard and apply pressure to the back of it. And then once you're done with that, you lift it up and the image has transferred. So then I'm just going over the design and the lyrics with a Sharpie to make it darker so you can see it. And that's it! For the second notebook, you just need any plain color notebook. And then I printed out a stencil of a heart on some cardstock and then I'm taping that in place onto the top of it. You can do this with any shape you want though. And then I'm going in with a gold paint pen and outlining the shape of the heart with little dots all the way around the edge. So then I'm basically just making dots all over the notebook. So I'm starting out with them closer together when I'm near the heart and then as I get farther and farther away, I'm spreading them out more to create kind of like a gradual effect. And that's it! You can totally customize this by doing it with any shape or image you would like. So the final design, I'm doing a folder, but you can also do it on a notebook if you would like. So I'm just taking a piece of scrapbook paper and cutting it down to the size of the folder. So I'm just tracing it so it's the exact same size and then cutting it out. And then I'm just taking some double-sided tape and attaching it onto the folder. typed out the lyric in between hometown and neon city which is from Kelsey Ballerini's song in between so then I just cut it out in the shape of a circle and am taping that down with some double-sided tape in the middle of the notebook so this notebook's really fun because you can completely customize it to any sort of scrapbook paper you like and any lyric or quote that means something to you
watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, you should give this video a thumbs up for me. And if you aren't already subscribed to my channel, you should definitely subscribe. Link is down there. I upload videos every single weekend and I have a lot of exciting back to school videos coming for you guys. So be sure to subscribe so you can be the first to see those. If you guys have any video requests, especially for back to school videos, be sure to leave those in the comments and I'll try my best to do them. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you with a new back to school video next weekend. Bye guys!